Hi, Mary. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Thanks for joining me. Getting ready to do our workout. La, la, la. Good afternoon, everyone. I'm Mary. Thanks for joining me today for our episode of Standing Conditioning Class. Let's get started by remembering a few things for safety. We want to make sure we have lots of space around us to move safely with no obstacles. Always make sure that you have your water bottle nearby so you can get some refreshment whenever you need to. You have loose, comfortable clothing on, safe and appropriate footwear, and always check in with your body. Listen to yourself. So if you need a break, it's okay to take one anytime. If you have a pain with one of the movements, just don't do that movement, okay? Let's work within a pain-free range. And always, if you happen to start to feel dizzy, lightheaded, trouble breathing, headache, nauseous, um, you know, any chest pains, irregular heartbeat, all those things mean you need to stop the routine altogether, okay? So just keep these things in mind. And if you happen to be by yourself exercising today, it's a good idea to call a friend or family member and ask them to check in on you by phone in about an hour. So let's get started. I'm going to put the music on and we'll begin with a nice warm up for all our body parts. Let's start with a deep breath in, reaching out and reaching out. One more, in through the nose, and out through the mouth. Now let's start with the neck. Look downward and upward four more times. Three, two, one. Now turn your head right to left five times. Four, make sure you're standing tall. Three, two, one. Good. Now let's lean the head to the side and the other side. Four, three, two. And last one. Good. Now shoulders up, breathing in and out. Lower them down. Two. Three. Four. Five. Good. Let's make big arm circles going forward. Breathing in and out. Two. Breathe in and out. Three. Four and five. Good job. Backwards. Breathe in and out. One, two, three. Loosen up those shoulders. Four, five. Now open up in front. One, two. Nice and wide. Three, four. Last one, five, good. Wide legs, let's reach towards the ground on one side and reach towards the ground on the other side. Two, three, you're doing it. Warming up those side muscles. And five, good. Now place your hands on your hips and turn your upper body, breathe in. And out as you turn to the right, breathing in, and out as you turn to the left. Two. Three. Four. And last one, side to side. Good. Now let's arch our back, push those shoulders back and the hips back, feeling that inward curve of your low spine. 
and let's breathe out, rounding the spine. Breathing in and out. Giving your back that movement. Three. Four. One more time. Five. Good. Let's bend those elbows. Push your arms behind you. Breathing in and out. Two more. And now I want you to keep your arms behind you and bend and straighten your arms. Two. Three. Working your triceps. Four. Wake them up. Five. Good. And the wrist. Around we go. Other way. Good. And hips side to side. Make a nice circle with those hips, side to back, to side to front, side to back, to side to front. Other way, side to back, to side to front. One more. Good. Let's lift those knees. And let's do a little bit of bending the knees now. Bend, bend, bend. Bend, let's tap to the front, to the side, to the back. Left leg, tap to the front, to the side, to the back. One more of those. Tap to the front, the side, and the back. And left leg, tap to the front, the side, and the back. Good. And now let's place our heel on the ground and lift the toe up and down, up. And down, up, down, up, down. One more. And your left leg. Lift that toe up and down. Feel that calf muscle working. A couple more. Good. Let's turn, put our toe on the ground now this time and turn our leg inward from the hip and outward from the hip. Inward and outward. And let's do the same with our left leg. Left toe on the ground, turn the leg inward and outward, inward and outward. One more. Good. Okay, now let's get started with our cardio. Now that we're all warmed up, let's get moving and grooving. Okay, everyone, make sure that you take a break whenever you need to. You know there's no pressure here. Just competing with yourself. So when you lift your feet up, make it a soft landing. Back onto the ground. Let's start moving those feet to the beat. And let's breathe in. In through the nose. And out through the mouth. Two more like that. Breathe in. Breathe out. Last one. Relax. Good job. Let's march. First thing we're going to do is add in the arms, reaching upwards and back down. Up and down. Up and down. Up and down. That's it. And last one. Let's march and breathe in the center. 
Breathing in through your nose, out through the mouth. Two more, like that. Keep those feet moving as you breathe. Last one. Okay. Now we're gonna do some taps with our heel to the front and step back in. Here we go. Heel, step, heel, step, heel, step. Heel, step, heel, step. Now let's take our right leg and tap that heel out the front and then our toe back five times like this. Heel, toe, heel, toe. Heel, toe, heel, toe, heel, toe. Good job, and march. Let's do it with the left. Heel, toe, heel, toe. Heel, toe, heel, toe. Heel, toe, and march. Now we're going to take our right leg and kick it up in front five times like this. Kick, 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 and march. Now let's try it with our left. Kick. Kick, 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 and march. All right, we're gonna do the same thing now, except we're gonna tap our toe to the side and back in five times. Start with that right leg, here we go. Tap, in, tap, in, tap, in, tap, in, tap, in, and march. Keep breathing. Let's do the left toe now, here we go. Tap, in, tap, in, tap, in, tap, in, tap, in, and march. Nice work. Now we're gonna kick that right leg out to the side five times. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, and march. And breathe. Now you know it, the left leg kicks. One, two, three, four, five, and march. Now, let's do some breathing. Open those arms. Breathe in. Breathe out. Two more. In through the nose. Out through the mouth. Last one. Good job. Okay, are you ready for some high knees? Let's do it. Here we go. Lift, 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 lift. Now, when we lift those knees, let's give a bicep curl. Bend the knees, curl the biceps. Breathe. Don't hold your breath. You're doing great. Getting that heart rate up. Good for the body, good for the lungs and the heart. Five. March in, breathe on the spot. Breathe in through your nose and out through your mouth. Two more. Okay, get ready to tap your toes to the back. Let's do it alternating right, then left. Here we go. Right, left, right, left, right, left. Breathe. Right, left, right, left. Can we add in some arms? Let's push them back. Push, 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 push. Getting that upper back into it. Tap, tap, each toe and back. Let's move to the right, and we'll start stepping to the left. 
together, right, together, left, together, right, together. Side to side. Now let's do some crisscross. Open and crisscross. Open and crisscross. That's it, you got it. Keep breathing, don't hold that breath. Open and close, crisscrossing your arms. Five, four, three, two, and final one. Let's march and breathe. In through the nose, out through the mouth. Two more like that. Give those muscles the oxygen they need to keep it moving. Okay, if you need a break, listen to your body. It's okay to take one anytime. If you feel you can keep on moving with me, let's do it. Let's do two side steps next. To the left side, so let's slowly move over to the right. And here we go. To the left, two times. Left, together, left, together. Now right, together, right, together. Left, left, right, right. Let's add and a clap at the end. Step, step, clap, step, step, clap, step, step, clap. Five, step, clap, four, step, clap, three, step, clap, two, step, clap, and last one. Nice job. March and breathe. In through the nose, out through the mouth. Again. Now it's time to do some forward, forward, back, back, stepping with one foot at a time. Here we go. Forward, forward, back, back. Forward, forward, back, back. Little steps. That's all you need to take. Forward and back. Forward and back. Now let's bring the arms with the feet forward and back, forward and back. Five, four, three, two, and final one. Good job. March and breathe. In through the nose, out through the mouth. Two more. Last one. Okay, now time to do some heel taps to the front, then step back and a reach. Heel, step, heel, step. Heel, step, heel, step. Let's reach when that heel goes up. Reach. Breathe as you reach. Heel, step and reach. Doing great, keep it up. Five, four, three, two, and last one. March and breathe, breathe in. And out. Again, breathe in. And out. Okay, now time to keep it crossed. Your body with your opposite leg, like this. Kick, 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 and kick. Now with your opposite arm, do a little reach forward when you kick. Or with the same arm. Either way, just breathe. Five, kick and reach, four, kick and reach, three, Kick and reach. Two. Kick and reach. Last one. Keep it up. Keep that marching going and breathe. In through the nose. Out through the mouth. Two more. Breathe in. And out. Doing great. We're almost there. Feeling nice and warm now. Let's bring those knees up one more time and tap with the opposite hand. Let's lift and tap. Lift and tap. Lift and tap. 
lift and tap. Now your opposite arm out to the side. When you lift and tap, if you like. Keep breathing. Left, right, left, 
Like that. Five. Four. Three. Two. Last one. Let's march and breathe. In through the nose. Out through the mouth. Okay, let's just do two more before we stop and cool it down. Breathe in and up. Okay, now time to take two steps to the left, two steps to the right. Starting with the left leg, let's step, step together, step together, right together, right together, left, left, right, right. Fill up at those arms, wiping down, round and down, down, round and down. Keep breathing. Very good. Five, four, three, two, and final one. Let's march and breathe. Okay, we'll come back with our last move, those heel steps with a punch forward and a press. Here we go. Heel step, heel step, heel step, and press, press, press. Let's breathe in through the nose, out through the mouth. Pressing upward, pressing upward till we reach overhead. You've got it. Hope you're feeling that warmth now. Have your whole body heated up. Good, 
other leg. Lift that toe and tap. Now out and in. Good. All right, now let's roll those shoulders forwards up, back and down. Breathing in and out. Deep breaths. One at a time. Good. Let's take our deep breaths in. Arms open and arms fall. Breathing in and out as wide as you can with your arms. Deep breath. Woohoo! You did it! Great job, everyone, with your cardio. I hope we worked up a sweat. Let's get a big drink of water, and then we're going to grab our weights, and we're going to do some exercise to strengthen our bodies. So make sure you have a chair now, something sturdy, and get your drink and your weights. How's everyone feeling? Are you doing okay? Remember to always check in with yourself and see how you're feeling. And remember, always take a break if you need one. So first thing we're going to do is we're going to get a sturdy chair to sit in. We're going to slide our hips to the front of it, checking our posture. And I want you to remember to keep that nice straight back throughout, okay? If you don't have weights, feel free to use water bottles, use soup can, vegetable can, or even just your body weight, and that's a great workout. So let's start with our side raises of our arms. Sitting tall, knuckles point outwards, and bring your arms halfway up, just to your shoulder height. Let's breathe in and breathe out. Breathe in, breathe out. Two, three, four, five. Breathing in and out. Six, seven. Eight, breathe in and out. You got it. Last one. Ten, good. Remember, with any exercise, if you need to stop before the tenth rep, take a break then. And the more you practice, the easier it'll become. Now let's work on our shoulders some more by placing our elbows at our sides the whole time, palms facing up, hands together, hands apart. Notice the elbows. Stay tucked to your side, two, three, breathe, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, Good, let's rest our weights on our thighs. We're gonna just apply gentle pressure on top of those weights and we're gonna slide our feet forward. We're gonna lift up our toes, okay? So let's lift the toes up for two seconds and then relax with that gentle pressure on top of your weight. One, two, down. One, two, down. Lift those toes, two, down. One, two, down. That's five. And down. One, two, down. That's six. One, two, down. Keep breathing. Eight, nine, and ten. Good. Now let's hold on to the weights with our goal post position. So our arms are at 90 degrees. Palms face outward. Let's breathe in first. 
Breathe out, push straight up for that overhead press. Two, three, breathing in and out. You got it. Five, making your body nice and strong. Six, breathe in and out. Eight, almost there. Last two, nine, and 10. Great job. Now place one weight behind you. We're just gonna use one weight now and we're gonna do a diagonal raise across our body. So take your weight in your right hand, place it outside your left thigh. See a nice straight arm. We're gonna breathe in first. And breathing out, we're gonna exhale up and across. And breathing in, down and across. Breathing out, up and across. Good. Working that shoulder and upper back. Three. Breathing in and out. Four. Stay with me. You're doing so good. Keep it up. Five. Breathing in and out. Six. Seven. Last three if you can. Let's Push it up. Eight. Nine. And last one. Ten. Woohoo! You did it. Let's switch arms now. With the weight in your left hand, place the weight outside your right thigh. So your arm is straight going across your body. Now sit tall. Let's breathe in first. Breathe out and up and across. One. Breathe in and out. Two. Three. Four. Five. Keep that breathing going. In and out. Six. Seven. We're almost there now. Last three if you can with me. Push it up. Eight. Nine. And final one. We did it. That's ten. Good job. Shake those shoulders out. They are working hard. Breathe in through the nose. And out through the mouth. Good. All right. Now let's do uh, something for our legs again. So we're gonna put those weights on top of your thighs and we're gonna straighten out our right leg, okay? So that heel's on the ground, the toe is pointing up. And feel free to tighten those stomach muscles leaning back slightly when you do this one. Let's lift our right leg up, bring it out, back in and down. Breathing in and out, in and out, throughout. Out, in, and down. That's three. Two more. Four. Last one. And five. Good job. Left leg now. Straighten it out. Heel touching the ground. Toe points up. Sit tall. Squeeze those stomach muscles. And let's breathe as we lift. Up, out, in, down. Breathing in and up, out, in, down. Using those big thigh muscles. Make those strong. Three. Two more. Four. Last one. We can do it. And that's five. Nicely done. Shake those legs out. Shake them out. All right. We'll do one more for the legs, and let's straighten that leg out, heel touching, toe pointing up again. It's okay if there's a little bend in the leg. Just try to have it as straight as you can comfortably. Now let's sit tall and breathe in. Breathe out, lift your leg up. Breathe in, lower it down. Out, lift it up. Breathe in, lower it down. Three more. Three. Four. Five, relax. Left leg, same thing. Heel touching, toe up. Breathe in. 
And breathe out as you lift. One, two, breathing in and out. Three, four, and last one. Good. Now let's take the weight, put it behind us. Use one weight, hold it on your chest, round your collarbone area. Have your wide legs, slide your feet forward a bit. We're gonna make sure we're at the front of the chair so we can lean back and then sit up tall again. Make sure that your back stays straight and you're holding backwards from your hips. Breathing in and out as you pull up. Keep looking forward. You don't wanna use your neck. You're using your stomach muscles to pull you forward. Three. Four. Five, six, if you want to make it more difficult, hold two weights. Seven, almost there, lean back, breathing in. Pull up tall, breathing out, eight. Are you feeling that in your tummy yet? Nine, last one. Ten, very good. Relax, breathe, shake it out. And we'll do the reverse now. Weight in between your hands, at your chest, wide legs. Lean forward from your hips, keeping your back straight. Sit up tall. Breathing in and out. Two. Now we're using our low back to pull us upright. You're doing great, everyone. Keep up the good work. Your body says thank you. Six, breathing in and out, seven, eight, final two, feel that now in your low back, nine, and ten, way to go everyone. Now we're going to shake things up a little bit and we're going to do some standing strengthening exercises with our weights. So I want you to get a nice drink of water, move the chair out of your way, and we'll be right back with some more strengthening and balance combined. Want to make sure you're doing okay and always listen to your body okay so if you need to take a rest take a rest that's totally okay make sure you had a nice drink of water and we're going to do some flies and tapping our toes to the side working both our arms and our legs so for the flies we open up and we bring the arms together now we're going to tap our toe out and bring it in opposite toe out and in so we go fly and tap, in, fly and tap, in, that's two, fly and tap, in, fly and tap, in, that's three, breathing in and out, throughout, four, five, breathe in and out, breathe in and out, six, Seven, almost there, last three. Remember, these are challenging using your whole body. If you need to take a break, you go right ahead. Last one, breathing in and out, in and out. Woohoo! lower your arms, shake the shoulders out. Breathe deeply in through the nose and out through the mouth. Now, we're gonna use our thighs and we're gonna do a little bit of punching forward. So let's take a nice slow march. And let's do a march and a punch. March and a punch. That's two. March, punch. Three, keep breathing. Four, breathing in and out. Five, six, 
legs, making your arms and your legs strong. Breathe, seven, eight, nine, last one, let's push, good job. Put one leg off to the side, and let's shake those shoulders out again, breathe. Now, for this one, we're gonna take the weight in our right hand, and we're going to use our left leg. So make sure it's the opposite arm and leg you're using. And we're going to do a bicep curl with this one. And we're going to use our thigh and we're going to use our back of the leg. So we're going to lift up our left knee when we bend our right elbow. Curl down. Now step back with your left foot, foot completely on the ground, and step back in. So let's curl down and curl again when you step back and then step back in. Curl down, it's a little bit of balance too. So take your time. Curl down, step back and in. Curl down, step back and in. Five more, curl. Down, step back, and in. Curl, down, step back, and in. Keep looking forward, last three, curl. Down, step back, and in. Last two. And last one, curl. Down, step back, in. Good. Now let's switch arms and legs. This time hold with your left arm and use your right leg. Now I know these are challenging, so just do what you feel you can, okay? If you want to take out the arm or the leg movements, go ahead. For an extra challenge, follow with both, okay? Left arm is going to curl. Keep the elbow next to your side. Right knee is going to come up. Curl, down, step back and curl, return. Down, step back and curl, return. A lot of coordination here, balance, strengthening. Step back and curl, return. If you want to put your opposite hand on your hip, whatever feels natural. Four, curl, down, step back and curl, return. Five. Six, almost there, curl, down, step back and curl, return, seven, Woo, that one got me, <laughs> curl, down, step back and curl, return, last two, curl, down, step back and curl, return, and last one, <laughs> That's not easy, is it? Good job, though, for trying it out. Now let's grab our two weights, and we'll do a squat with our toes pointed out to the side. And I want you to grab onto the weights with your palms facing upwards. We're going to do a squat, push the hips back, then a row, pull your elbows back. Squat, row. Okay, so when we stand up tall, we put our arms back out. Squat, row. Squat, row. Squat, row. Three. All right, when we stand up tall, our elbows go back. Five. Squat, row. Six. Breathe in. Out. Seven. Eight. Almost there. Nine. And ten. good job. Shake that out and breathe in through your nose, out through your mouth. We'll do one more. This is still balance and strengthening. We're going to use our triceps. Now we're going to use our calf muscles. We're going to have our arms out to the side. We're going to straighten the arms using our triceps and bend them again. But when we straighten them, we're going up onto the toes. 
and coming down. Now, if it's too difficult, you can just keep your feet flat on the ground and do the tricep part, okay? Let's breathe throughout. One, and close. Two, and close. Three, and close. Four, close. Remember, keep looking forward and go slow up onto the toes and back down. Six, almost there. Seven, breathing in and out. Eight, nine, and final one. Way to go. Let's get rid of these weights. Say goodbye to those. We're all done with those. We're going to stretch now. And let's start with some standing stretches. Feel free to grab a chair so you can have one close by you for when we go to sit down in a moment. Get a nice big drink of water. Let's start with that calf stretch. Come nice and close to the back of your chair. Big step back with one of your legs. Bend that front knee. Keep the back leg straight. Heel on the ground, toes pointing forward and breathe into the stretch. Deep inhales and exhales. Step forward and switch legs. Stretch your inner thighs, nice wide legs. You can still do this behind your chair. I'm just turning to the side so you can see better. Let's breathe in first. Breathe out, bend one knee, shifting your weight over to that leg, keeping your hips pushed back so the weight's in your heel. Breathe. Feel the stretch? Right there. Stand tall, breathing in, breathing out, opposite leg. Good. Now, let's, let's take our heel and bring it towards our bottom. Stand tall, breathe. Hold your chair for support. Good, opposite leg, same thing. Good, now let's have a seat and finish off with our seated stretches. Begin by breathing in through the nose, reaching up and stretch as high as you can, holding that stretch. Breathe. Release. You worked so hard today. Keep up the good work, everyone. Right hand, right shoulder. Lift that elbow, hold it high and breathe. Left hand, left shoulder, lift and breathe. Let's stretch our neck. Bring your chin down to the chest. Press your shoulders back. Breathe.
Now lean your head to the right. Ear towards the shoulder, relax the shoulders. To the left, relax and breathe. Deeply in through the nose, out through the mouth. Shoulder stretch, right hand to the left shoulder. Under your elbow, grab your upper arm, bring it towards you and to the left. Left arm to the right. Under your arm, bring your elbow to the right. Good. Now bring your arms with your thumbs up all the way behind you till you can grab onto the bottom part of your backrest. Squeeze the shoulder blades behind you. Breathe, chin up. That's a great one, isn't it? For the chest and the biceps. Now fingers interlock, and I want you to make this circle with your arms and gently round your back. You're pulling your belly button inward and your shoulder blades forward. Good, relax. Now wide legs, bring your right arm up and over your head, gazing at the ceiling so you feel a stretch on your right side. Support yourself with your elbow on your leg. Your left arm up and over. Hands outside your right thigh, so tall breathing as you turn to look behind you. If it feels okay, bring your right arm behind, pointing behind you. Hands outside your left. Sit tall and breathe. Turn and look behind your left shoulder. Left arm can come behind you. Wide legs. Pinky fingers furthest away from you, holding on to your legs. Bring your right shoulder towards that left knee, pressing into your right leg. Feeling a stretch in your back. Breathing and switching sides. Press into that left leg now. Wide legs, breathing in, sitting tall. Breathing out, folding forward. Keep your head up. Or if it feels right for you, you can relax your head and neck and shoulders. Coming up slowly. Let's lift the knee up, hold it towards you, close and breathe, sit tall. Knee on your opposite, foot on your opposite knee, sit tall with the back, breathe into the stretch. On the exhale, if it's comfortable for you, bend forward from your hips. Keep your head upright, don't force the stretch. Now lift the knee towards you, stretching your glutes, breathe. Left knee up, hug it close, breathe. Opposite foot, 
opposite knee now with that foot. Sit tall and breathe. Release all that tension in your body. Bend forward at the hips as you exhale to increase that stretch in your hip. Lift the knee, hugging it, stretch your glutes. Good, last stretch now. Let's straighten out one leg, heel touching the ground, toe points up with your hands on your other leg. Breathe in, sitting tall with your back. And breathe out as you bend from the hips, coming forward, feel that stretch down the back of your leg. Breathe into the stretch. Good, let's switch legs. Sit tall, inhale and exhale, bending from the hips forward, breathe. Very nice, everyone. What a nice group today for joining me. Thank you so much. You did such great work. Keep it up. And remember, Care First has uh, our Fit-a-thon starting July 1st to 11. So while you're staying at home and being fit with me, why not fundraise as well? You can check out more information about that and how we can raise funds to help seniors in the community by going to carefirstontario.ca. And also, if you have other friends that are having trouble getting on to Zoom, um, what you can do is just have them call us at the Care First Wellness uh, number. That's 647-416-847. That's, uh, Eight nine three nine. Okay, so four one six eight four seven eight nine three nine, and you can find out how you can join in our live Zoom feeds with no registration or password necessary. You just need the app, and you just need the uh, Zoom ID. Okay, everyone, have a great rest of your day. Thanks for joining me. Working hard. Mary.